Well, our next story is fascinating indeed. It's all about pushing it to the limit with Mercy Oviedo. I'm loving the way her name sounds, but I'm loving what she's doing even more. In case you yourself are not familiar with Mercy, she's Kenya's first female Olympian weightlifter. Yes, and the fact that it is a male-dominated sport, we go ahead and take a look at how she started off and of course how she plans on challenging some of the world's greats. Have a look. Weightlifting is very challenging. I love challenging stuff. So it's been very interesting and motivating. I have to keep up the hard work. I'm a bronze medalist, all Africa Games, so I want to fall into the medal bracket at the Commonwealth Games, so I really have to really work hard and show good performance. My name is Marcio Bire, and I've been doing weightlifting since 2000. Before I was playing hockey in school and I was running as well. So I decided to switch into weightlifting because I thought that's where I could push my strength to a higher level. It's been very challenging, especially from the start. I almost gave up. Through the week, uh, starting from Monday through to Saturday, I train three hours a day, sometimes even twice a day, if I have enough time. But I always give myself three hours in a day, six days a week for training. Before, always before my workout, I have to come in, do a little bit, little bit of stretches, warming up, a little bit of warming up, and then I can start up with my lifts. In weightlifting, you have to be very careful because when you're lifting heavy weights, like for example squatting, you need to support your back. We have a very good belt which you put on when you're squatting. When you're doing the clean and jack, because you have to support your back, keep it well in position. Yeah, and you also use good technique. We have very good technique to when you're doing weightlifting, so that's what helps you not get injuries. So, a snatch movement, snatch movement. The one who lifts the highest, the heaviest weight in the Anapata, the more points. In the clean and jack, you get the weight from down to shoulder level, and then you push it overhead. Okay, the snatch movement is just one movement. Get the weight from down, pull it all the way up. Just one movement for the snatch. We've participated in all Africa Games, Commonwealth Games. We've gone, I've gone up to Olympic Games, London 2012. And my best moment was at the All Africa Games, Congo Brazzaville 2015, where I won three bronze medals. Yeah, then the following year, 2016, we had uh, Olympic qualifiers for Rio and uh, I managed to get uh, silver in the clean and jack and bronze in the snatch. Actually there's a few lifters who I look up to. Most of them are men like uh, this guy, he's called Kechanke from Cameroon. He's a very strong guy in weightlifting. 85 category. It's very inspiring. I always watch his videos and I follow him on Instagram. And we also have ladies like uh, Janet Thelamont from Seychelles, very strong lady as well. Yeah. Ooh. Lifting in Kenya is not very popular like football and athletics and rugby. Maybe we need to get more coverage in the TV, media, but it's a good sport coming up. We're introducing kids into it. 
I've got five young girls I'm training at the moment, including my daughter, so that they can pick up also. Uh, weightlifting is a very good sport for men, ladies, girls, boys, even kids as young as seven years old can do weightlifting. And it's also good for ladies because you end up toning up, keeping fit, it works your cardiovascular area, and it's a good thing. For the men also, it gives you good physique, you balance your whole body, you strengthen your back muscles, your hands, your legs, your arms, shoulders. So it's a full body workout for everyone. Yo, Mike, that is not a lady you want to meet on like the middle of a street and start getting into a fight with. Yeah, no, nope. <laughs> does look, but she's doing great things, man. She's crushing limits. She's surpassing everything that she right. set out to do. Yeah. What I want to know is when you're in the gym next time, mm -hmm. you're going to stack up on the weights and Still try. Still working on that one pack, though. <laughs> then we're going to get to the weights.